Hi, welcome to Tech Ranch, a place where we learn and earn technical skills in the most efficient way. Let's make coding fun. Practice project ideas, unit converter. Today, we are going to present you a live demonstration of unit converter desktop Windows based application implemented using Java Swing graphical user interface. Before we get into the demonstration, let's first see what all requirements you will need to do. So number one, we need to make sure it is an offline or desktop or Windows based Java application for computing unit conversion. Here we are going to see all the important units or matrix converter for length, weight, temperature, speed and many more matrix conversion like currency and uh, height, weight and many more. You will see precise values of output and converted values into main values to maintain the accuracy. We'll make sure we'll have verification and validation for wrong input or empty input boxes. Now, when it comes to the implementation, there will be three uh, parts out of which you first see the user interface, the uh, frames, the windows, the button, text box, and every user interface component was designed and implemented using Swing Graphical User Interface API. So first we are going to create a frame. It's very simple and basic uh, swing based uh, unit converter application, which will have frames, buttons and text box. There will be five classes. One will be your four main window and uh, number two will see the temperature and the height for the height converter, weight converter and currency converter. So basically we are going to cover all these four important units and matrix converter temperature from celsius to fahrenheit and kelvin height in different units and weight and currencies in case of validation we have to see we have to make sure we need to check for the empty input or the valid input or we we'll validate some and display some messages for uh, debugging the errors and uh, inputs demonstrations as you can see here this will be the main page where we'll see the options in the button form so we create a frame for individual window and this frame every frame will have a design in text box and buttons and display messages as a label so here we can see in the main page we can see temperature currency weight and height and exit and in another uh, windows, the child windows from this main page will have the converter for temperature, for height and weight and currencies. So you can see oh, the input you need to give something which is valid. So like this, you can see, and if you click any of these button, it will convert the entire units for that particular input. So let's take a look at, uh, for example, if you see here for the width and weight conversion, when I have entered 34 milligram, it is converted to all the other units like gram, kilogram and ton. So this is what the concept behind this converter. Similarly for currency, like if I enter for Bangladesh, it will convert for other currencies too. And from every window, you can go back to the main window and you can clear it and exit then and there. Now let's take a look at the demonstration. This is my Eclipse ID and here is my application. It's a single swing based graphical. It's a unit in, uh, let's take a look at the demonstration. This is my Eclipse ID and here is my application. So it's a swing based Java application. So it has to execute for Java console. And this is how the execution look like. As you can see, unit converter, temperature, currency, weight, height, and we can exit. Now, first, let's take a look at the temperature conversion. So here, if I entered any value to Calvin, it will convert to Celsius and Fahrenheit from this number. If you see, so it's saying, please check input. This is what the validation part, because there is no value for Fahrenheit. So you need to 
convert from Kelvin. So here, and it will give you the precise and negative values too. So that will help you to maintain the accuracy of the data or the value. From here, you can go back to the main menu. And uh, so for from here, you can convert the weight. So if I give any number to kilogram, and if I try to convert gram, it will say your input is empty. And if I convert this, it will give me the entire values for other units. If you see height, so millimeter, centimeter, meter, and everything. And if I try to convert, so your input is empty. I need to give some value. So decimeter, if I give this value, so this is what the conversion. For currency, similarly, if you see, for India, 15, 45, this is how it is executing. And you can go back to the main menu. And if you want to see this, you can also clear the data and you can exit from any point. So this was the live demonstration of unit and metric converter implemented using Swing Graphical User Interface API and conversion of length, height, weight, temperature and currency. Also, I wanted to show you the code which is very simple. I really uh, wanted to show you the simple code. Every class has main method. Every, for example, for height, it is a different class. It's very simple. It has created different frames for different class, for different window. Or you can even invoke from the main page. So what is happening, you can simply add more classes and include it in the main page. That's very simple. And this is uh, very simply created this code, although you can do it many ways. But here it's created just a frame for every converter window and uh, used for using switch cases for basing based by the choices of the user and uh, you can even create your own color design it on your own so for example set background gray white this is how we can change the color you can change the font family and style and design and you can make your button different buttons colors and all so all these things you can add on your own and customize it accordingly this type of application being used many places when students want to learn how to convert or sometimes these calculations are helping us to uh, convert the values we have it in our real life applications you can use it for the real-time project and uh, you can use it in your own spaces to convert and compute the different in case of any questions and concerns and source code needed, please email to techranch2019 at gmail.com. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to our channel and stay tuned for more upcoming interesting informative sessions. And do post your comments and feedback for improve our quality services. Let's make coding fun. Thank you.